She is in the air I breathe Feel her in the songs I sing Even when I'm out of reach She always finds me I've known this little girl and her sister for a very long time. Matter of fact, uh, one of the first times I got to meet her, um, she got lost and I found her and took her back to her parents. Uh, actually, I had a, we had a party at our house and they forgot and left her there. Uh, but as soon as they got home, they quickly came back for you. Now, Paul said something that was kind of controversial, but he said a woman should be submissive to her husband. And I guess that's where we got this thing of obey, you know? But, you know, we've kind of dropped the concept of that because of maybe of political correctness or because of the fact that women have promised it but never done it for years. So we just, <laughs> so we just dropped that part. But, the, but what we miss out on is really the next part that said a husband will love his wife as Christ so loved his church. There can't be any greater love than that. So with that commitment, that kind of commitment toward each other, do you, Kristen, Renee, Williams, and Taylor Kent, Gregory, freely and deliberately choose each other as partners in this holy estate. And if you have no just cause why you should not be so united, please join hands. <laughs>first time Kristen came home talking about the goofy guy who picked her up on the golf cart at the TS Drax. She looked at me and said, he's a goofball, but he's kind of cute. <laughs> a short time later, um, they began dating and shared some pretty dramatic moments that changed both of their lives forever. I remember those moments and looking at Kristen and saying, you know you're going to marry him, don't you? Now here we are on this special day and I'm so blessed to have been able to stand beside you all. We love you all so much and wish you all the happiness in the world. Here's to Kristen and Taylor. may wonder why I was chosen to be the best man today. To be honest, I'm the only one of Taylor's friends that can read, write, and in fact talk. <laughs> Taylor, we might not know each other for the longest time, but for the years we have, we have done some pretty dumb stuff. From burning our couch, to throwing a shopping cart off the balcony in Panama. <laughs> there, is never, there is never a dull moment with you. In all seriousness, I want to thank both families for this wonderful wedding. I also want to thank Taylor and Kristen for allowing me to be a part of their special day. I wish you all a lifetime of happiness. Cheers to the bride and groom. She is in the air I breathe, feel her in the songs I sing. Even when I'm out of reach, she always finds me.
can't remember life before I don't know where I'd be She gave my heart direction There in my time of need. Taylor, uh, in taking the woman you hold by your, your right hand to be your lawful and wedded wife, before these witnesses present, do you promise to love her, to honor and cherish her in this relationship, and leaving all others to cleave only unto her, and to be to her in all things a true and faithful husband, so long as you both shall live? If you do so promise, say, I do. I do. Very good. Kristen, in taking this man you hold by the right hand to be your lawful and wedded husband, before these witnesses present, do you promise to love him, to honor and cherish him in that relationship, and leaving all others, cleave only unto him, and to be to him in all things a true and faithful wife, so long as you both shall live? If you do so, promise, say, I do. I do. Now, Taylor, as you give this ring, Say after me. You do have to repeat something. <laughs> you got me. Yeah. With this ring. With this ring. I thee wed. I thee wed. In token and pledge. In token and pledge. Of my abiding faith. Of my abiding faith. And enduring love. And enduring love. Now, Kristen, as you give this ring to Taylor, say after me. With this ring. With this ring. I thee wed. I thee wed. In token and pledge. Token and pledge. Of my abiding faith. Of my abiding faith. And enduring love. And enduring love. Place it on his okay. Now, in the name of the Commonwealth of Kentucky, I pronounce you husband and wife. And now may the God uh, of peace prosper and bless you in this new relationship. Anything else? You may kiss the bride. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. and Ms. Gregory.